I don't know. I ain't no scientist. Good morning, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton, and I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboy. I, uh, finished disassembling those walls, had a, a little nap. Nice little nappy nap. And now I'm gonna have the rest, the rest of my disgusting sandwich for breakfast. Yeah. Look at all that boredom and unhappiness. I'm thinking... I'm thinking mall today. Um... But yeah, after after just surviving a scratch, I'm I'm a little hesitant to do so. Maybe I should bring some supplies, some some whatnots. Hmm. It's it's a hard call to make. I'll say that much. Hmm. This fish fillet is going bad, so I'll go ahead and eat the last one of those. It did stay good for a couple of days. And now uh, I'm a shirtless man, running through the woods. Being crazy! We're just crazy! Okay. Got a, got a few baddies here. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Okay, back up. One, two, three! Come on! Okay, there's one down. Two down. Three down. Alright. What you got in your wallet? Nothing? Picture of your wife? Hmm. Not bad. She probably looks worse now. Boom. I don't know where these guys keep coming from. Making me real nervous. Considering a trip to the mall would, uh... Yeah. Would attract most of the zombies. And I'm really not in so much need of stuff. I think maybe the mall is one of those trips that you want to make first thing if you're going to make it at all. Hello? <laughs> it's just chasing this chick swinging a bat. She didn't notice at all. They're kind of dumb. Zombies are kind of dumb for people who eat brains. You are what you eat, but not these guys. Mm-mm. So, um... Maul? Yes? No? Maybe so? Start running down this way, see what we come across. Lots of zombies is what we're gonna come across. Because I don't think I've been down this way in a while. Mostly we've been going upwards to the north. Oh my god. That guy almost got me. Everybody almost got me! Ugh. There's a chick wearing a, a gold bling. She's got her bling a bling. Do, do do ladies wear bling? I guess they can wear bling. That's fine. If you want. What is this place? Oh. It's a store. With a bunch of rotten shit in it. <laughs> Smells awful. Oh, I remember this store. Yes, this will keep me happy for quite a while. See what I mean? There's not so much reason to go to the mall. I have a... Uh, a lot of wood glue and duct tape and nails and can get as many planks as I like. So I don't, I don't want to ris risk a trip to the mall. I think I've given this some heavy, serious consideration, and uh, I think it's safer if I just stay at home. Nope, don't get up, don't get up. Just, just stay there. I'm gonna read this magazine. I can get rid of my sadness. Oh wow! Look at this. Lip gloss for, for ladies. That's so wonderful. I'm glad I know about this now. I'm sure it's going to be applicable in my new life. As a zombie killing machine. I am the zombie killing machine. Boom. Another one? Hey. Lay down. There you go. Piece of cake, right? Right, right? And once again, I'm still a little unhappy, so I'll read this book. Get rid of my unhappiness. Nice. And, uh, exertion still hanging around. But that's fine. What's over this way? A bunch of trees? Is that all? Should I build a, a little shack over here? That could be fun. I really like the carpentering 
Especially now that I'm uh, pretty good at it. Don't want to toot my own horn, but I'm pretty fucking good at it now. I can make stairs. What you know about that, kid? Oh, another zombie heard me. Heard the battle going on. Come on, why are you so strong? Or why am I so weak? I don't understand. My scratch is all healed. Yeah, there are so many zombies. Not not really a horde, but uh, definitely a gathering. A little a, a little bit of a shindig for the zombies. They're having a good time together, drinking the uh, the LSD spiked fruit punch. That's why they walk around that way. I don't know if you knew that, but all zombies are on LSD. <laughs> And you might be saying to yourself, well, Dayton, I want to be a zombie. Don't do that. Don't do that. You can just find some LSD. It'll be temporary. But even even temporary is, like, uh, a little too long to be tripping that hard. Oop. Yeah, they're just hiding in the trees. They get naked, run through the woods. Dayton does does that, but uh, he doesn't need drugs to do it. Drugs are not cool, you guys. And this is the, the warehouse area. <clears throat> I kind of wonder what is past the warehouses. I don't think we've gone past them. We kind of got got stopped up and uh, searched through all those places. Picked up some batteries, picked up some wood planks. Oh, there's a burger shop. I think we've seen that before, too. Judging by the amount of bodies outside. <clears throat> Come on! Oh, it's my exertion. My exertion's a little too high, so I can't smash these zombies up as good as I should. That's alright. Just uh, run a little more, head into the burger shop, see if I can find some Frenchy fries. Mmm. What a treat. Hello? Rotten bacon. <clears throat> Not good. Not good. If I could get some eggs. If I get a some butter and a frying pan, I could I could cook those up pretty good. Fresh uncooked frozen pork chop. You know what? I am going to make myself a little pork chop. Mmm. That's nice. That's real good. Real good now. And then it'll also uh, fix my exertion, I do hope. There's an awful lot of banging going on. Okay, grab that. Back to regular time. Eat your pork chop. Mmm. Grease running down your forearms. Eating pork chops like a wild man. Broccoli seeds, plastic bin. I wonder if you could use those plastic bins to, uh... To catch some rainwater. I do have plenty of rain collectors, but a rain collector that you don't need to construct yourself seems like a good idea. And I thought I saw a little bit of rain happening in the upper right corner of the screen. But I guess that was a lie! Hey! There's a, a gas station here. I'm just gonna walk through the car wash to wash the uh, grease off of my arms. <laughs> the pork chop grease? Hmm. I'm feeling fresh. <coughs> and I don't have to feel bad about paying ten dollars for that, uh... that wash. Because money doesn't mean anything anymore. Somebody shut that fucking dog up. That dog was actually in the game this time. <laughs> this time? I'm sure we'll have some real dogs eventually. That's what we do! Yeah, they're all wandering around now. Looking for the source of that sound. Okay. Seems relatively safe now. This is a, a pretty good place. But we'll need to clear it out just a little bit. Level up that blunt accuracy skill. I think it is about ready to level. Blunt accuracy, yep. I just need the, uh, the skill point in order to do it. We'll get it. They only locked one of the doors. Silly. That's so silly. 
Oh wow. Sawed off shotgun. Don't mind if I do. And then can I can I like reload this thing or or what? Ammo count five plus one. So are we are we good? Are we all full here? Empty gas can. I guess I should grab that. Bunch of magazines. Junk, junk, junk. Chewing gum, energy drink. Yeah. There's not going to be anything healthy in here. Mmm. Pizza. I'll eat some frozen pizza. I actually do really like cold pizza. It is quite delicious, if I do say so myself. Hmm. There's an empty gas can. There's another one. I don't know how many gas cans I'm going to need, but uh, I'll take all that I can get. And I don't necessarily need to, f to haul them all back home. I could just fill them and leave them laying around here. Nobody's going to steal these. Because, mm. yeah, if I, if I try and fill these, it's going to mean a trip back home almost immediately. I, I probably can't carry seven of them. There we go. I just want to get these filled up before the power goes out. That seems uh, like a good idea. Good idea, if I do say so myself. So one, two, three... Oh, is that out of fuel now? I guess so. The reservoir uh, under the ground only has so much fuel. And I'm sure as the Zombocalypse was uh, impending, people made a run on the fucking gas station for sure. A little more fuel. Alright. Now we'll just place these gently on the floor. Because I don't want to haul them all back home. <laughs> Not quite yet. Hmm. I do want to kind of use this shotgun as well. But not necessarily near the gas station, because <laughs> it doesn't seem like a good idea. I don't know. I ain't no scientist. But I'm going to guess that's probably a, a stupid thing to do. So, okay. I'll round up some zombies. Hey, buddies. Come this way. Come with your old pal Dayton. And I'll get away from the point away from the gas station. I'm actually walking closer to the gas station. But, uh, they seem lined up pretty good. How's that? Twofer! <laughs> and, uh, that is all I have for ammo. So I've got six shots to go in the shoot guns. Oh my. Six shots is... It's not gonna be enough. It's never enough. And now I'm panicking just a little bit. Okay. Just keep a good a good distance between you and them. Get them in a nice big pile. And then I could I could probably shoot a bunch of them at the same time, right? Or just one. I think that's it. No, that's it. Now click click. Alright. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Now we've got some, some friends showing up. I could beat them down. Yeah. They're not all in a big horde. Just trying to get some levels up. Level up my everything. Gold, diamonds, everything. I am the super level king. Alright. Good, good, good. Hey. Hey, old man, turn around. Old man river. He's a zombie. He's like that, uh, Rip Van Winkle fella. He slept forever, except this time he's walking around while he's sleeping. Sleepwalking. Dead sleepwalk. Mmm. Pop. I take some pop. We got an empty pop can, which I think you can make some uh, some ammo or something with that. Or is that the tin can? What's the difference? Tin versus aluminum, there is a big difference. 
But I don't know. Maybe you can make some some shitty ammo out of the a tin can or aluminum can. Hmm. I bet there's some mysteries down here. Or maybe it's just a, a train track that will will follow forever. Can't go too far. It is uh two o'clock in the afternoon. I just want to see if there's anything down this way. Any adventures to be had. And it doesn't seem so. It's like a bunch of, uh, a bunch of nothing. I don't want to get too lost in the woods either. That's not going to be good. If I have to sleep in the woods, mm-mm. No, sir. I ain't going to do it. Well, I was hoping that there would be uh, more past this, but it looks like about the end of the road. Maybe down this way. Hmm. There's gotta be something. I do see some light poles over that way. Above the tree line, there's a light pole. Civilization. Kinda. <laughs> Not really. Just a little. Oh well. I tried. I tried. I just I just wanted to to have a little adventure. That's all. Um I'm gonna stick the shotgun in the bag. Keep it for later. Cause you know I love my shoot guns. Yes, sir. What do I need to level? Two sixty one XP. Hmm. It should be relatively easy to get. I wish there was like a, a running magazine that you could read and learn how to increase your sprinting faster. There's carpentry books and shit, so if you can get a skill multiplier from that, why can't you read a running magazine and be like, oh, now I know the proper running technique. You keep your body straight and you, you move your arms in a piston-like motion while moving your legs in the same fashion. Hey, piece of cake. But I guess the only way to really uh, become a good runner is to actually run. Which is why I'm not a good runner. <laughs> ah. Ah, that makes me laugh. Hmm, do I need this pop can? I don't think I need it. Oh my god. Now I've dropped all my nails and my saw. Awesome. Great, great decision. Ah. Fart. I need all this back. Pop can I don't need. Nails I do need. Okay. Good to go. Just dropped a little stuff. <laughs> I'm stupid, sorry. Oh my god, I also have some, some farming going on behind the uh, the restaurant base that I need to check on. I haven't slept in the restaurant base in quite a while. I think it's up this way. Don't go down that way. That's just the uh, the warehouses. The men's warehouse. You're going to like the way you look. I guarantee it. You know what I'm talking about? That really old ass commercial? Probably not many people do. Because it's a really old ass commercial. This fridge has been looted. I think I've been here before. Hmm, okay, across the street from the church. My house be just up this way. And there's my farmins out back. Probably. I think some of this rotted while it was in the ground. Young strawberry plants. Mmm. In bloom. So can I can I harvest it? Might I harvest this now? I guess not. In bloom does not mean uh you can pick it. I guess it's fully grown or something. What about this? What's over here? Rotten broccoli. Okay, well, I guess we'll just leave this to rot then. <laughs> I kind of forgot about this. Rotten potatoes. That ain't good. Fuck. It's all dead. It's all dead. I planted and I planted and I broke my back and, and it just died. Oh well. We'll keep an eye out on the uh, strawberry plants. It seemed like a good idea. 
And I kind of want to test out this generator. Hmm. Just see if I uh, attract some attention. Because I'm thinking I might need to build a second wall here just to uh, to seal the generator in. Then I'll have that double layer protection that I do enjoy so much. Hmm. Generator info. It's good. It's good. Hmm. Do I dare turn it on? I think everything's running in here just fine. Yeah, lights are on. I hear the fridge is going. I think everything's okay. I think everything's just fine here. I'll drop this shotgun off somewhere. Expert cooking, master farming. Where's that? Where's that? Hmm. Am I an expert cook yet? I don't think so. I think I'm just pretty good. But yeah. I need to get through levels 5 and 6. That advanced cooking. Alright. Then we got a bunch of, uh... Double Op Buck. I'm gonna grab one of these. What you got for me? Hmm... Where did I put my shoot guns? Yeah, we're going to do a little more target practice today. That's what we do today. And this is a big-ass canister of uh, ammo. Can we just uh, empty this out? Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Now we're looking pretty good. Hmm... Should go take my revenge. Very heavy load. Okay. It's not a back-breaking load. I just got my movement speed a little reduced. It's almost time for Betty Bye. But I don't really want to go Betty Bye yet. I want to run around and kill some zombies. Then again, if I get stuck at that fucking gas station, I don't have any sheets with me or anything. It's not going to be a good idea. I suppose we could save it for the next episode. Something like that. Alright. Load these shells up until the bag's full. 250 12 gauge shells? That, that would be so heavy. Much heavier than 10 pounds, if you ask me. Packing, packing, packing. Ow. We got a lots of those. Alright. So, in the next episode, we're going to, uh, do some, some rampant murders. <laughs> I'm going to shoot everything and anything that comes within a foot of me. Let's see. Am I almost good on the aiming? No, not really. <laughs> reloading is ready to level, but I guess reloading doesn't really matter that much. Reload faster? Like, yeah. Unless you're dealing with a fucking gigantic horde, I think uh, you can take a couple extra seconds to reload. Or if you're, yeah, PvPing. But we, we ain't got no PvP to worry about. And it's kind of nice. Anyways, friends, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to like, comment, and don't subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. And if you do, friends, I'll send you a scrunchie. Just like the, the girls used to wear in the, in the, in the grade, you know? When you were little. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. It's a, it's a woman's fashion accessory. That's about what I know. Anyways. It's not applicable in the zombie apocalypse, but we're not there yet. So, so, so remember to like. And, and I'll send you one. Probably. Maybe. Perhaps. Not really. Anyways, <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. And until then, bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.